Yeah, so welcome my viewers. Uh, on today's lesson, we are going to cover a topic in form 3. And the topic is the equation of a circle. The equation of a circle. Now, I'm going to provide a question here. I'm going to provide a question uh, for the equation of a circle. And the question that I'm providing here, you are given, you are to find the center, the center, and the radius, the radius of the circle, of the circle, given the equation, given the equation, given the equation. So the equation is this one, 4x squared plus 4y squared minus 8x plus 20y minus 7 is equals to 0. Minus 7 is equals to 0. So therefore, there is a question. There is a question. You are required to find the, the, the radius and the center. The center and the radius of the circle. So therefore, the radius and the center of the circle. So therefore, in the first place, uh, step number one is to make the coefficient of x squared. To make the coefficient of x squared and y squared 1. So therefore, this equation 4x squared plus 4y squared minus 8x plus 20y minus 7 is equal to 0. You make it, you make it uh, 1. So divide by 4, divide by 4, divide by 4, divide by 4, divide by 4. To so get x squared plus y squared minus 2x plus 5y minus 7 over 4 is equal to 0. That is step number 1. You make the coefficient of x squared and y squared uh, 1. That's what you do. So that's step number 1. So divide both sides, all, all, all the terms, by 4. So therefore, you make x squared and y squared 1. Then the next thing, bring this x, x squared and x, so that you complete the square. x squared minus 2x plus y squared plus 5y this is minus 7. You take this minus 7 over 4, you take it on the other side. You take it on the right hand side. So that you complete the square on this. You complete the square for x squared minus, minus 2x and y squared plus 5y equals 7 over 4. So I want us to, to solve this one by completing the square. While you are completing the square, what you do, while this coefficient of x squared is 1, now y squared is 1, you are supposed to complete the square. Whatever you add here, you also add it on the, the other side. Whatever the term that you add in y squared plus 5y plus a certain value, you add it on the other side. So, therefore, the easiest way to find the, this one, when you complete the square, it's like you find the square root of this one, x, and this one, the value, this 2, which is b divided by 2, you get it like that. You divide by 2, you get x squared x minus 1 squared plus now by doing this you have already completed the square and factorized when you factorize you get this this is a square number so plus the same case applies to this you find the square root of y then you take this 5 divided by 2 you get 5 over 2 is 2.5 squared you have already completed the square by the time you write y plus 2.5 squared this is already completed square if you expand this you get, uh, you get this one plus now c. You get this term plus c. Now you have already completed the square. It's equal to seven over four. Plus now this value that you get here, you put it on the other side to a square minus one square, and this plus two point five squared. Two point five squared. So that is what you are supposed to do in this question. That's what you are supposed to do in this question. That is what you are supposed to do in that question. So then, the next thing, evaluate this, 7 over 4, 7 over 4, 7 divided by 4, that is 1.75. So get x minus 1 squared plus y plus 2.5 squared is equal to 1.75 plus 1 plus 6.25. Because this is minus 1 squared, minus 1 squared is uh, 1. So therefore, when you add this one, 
you get this is 9. You get x minus 1 squared plus y plus 2.5 squared is equals to 9. Is equals to 9 like that. Is equals to 9. So when you write that. So once you reach that level, remember the formula of finding this the equation of a circle. The general formula of finding the equation of a circle is given by x minus a squared plus y minus b squared equals to r squared. Where a and b are the centers. Where a and b are the centers. So this is x minus a squared, y minus b squared equals to r squared. That's the equation of a circle. So therefore, this is the same. So for you to find the values of the value of r, and the value of a and b at this level, you are supposed to find the square root of both sides. You find the square root of both the right hand side and the right hand side. So what you find the square root of this side here now? X minus 1 squared plus y plus 2.5 squared is equal to 9. You find the square root of this one and the square root of this. You get this that x minus x minus 1 equal to 0 and y plus 2.5 equated to 0. Therefore, once you write that, so this becomes x is equals to uh, negative 1. Sorry, sorry, x is equals to 1. Once you take it on this side, and then y is equals to 2.5, negative. Negative 2.5. So therefore, the center is 1, negative 2.5. The center is, the center is, 1, negative 2.5. That's the center. 1, negative 2.5. Then, this is r squared. Our r squared equals 9. So what is r? r is equal to 3. You find the square root. The square root of 9 is 3. So therefore, that is how you find the equation of the circle. That is how you find the equation of the circle using uh, that method. So that's a question provided. So therefore, step number 1, Make x coefficient of x squared and y squared one dividing everything by by four, and then you find the center is one negative two point five, and r is three. R is equals to three. R is equals to three.